I gotta get to work for real, man. Quit playing. What's up, Scorpio? Let's get into it. America, man, she is so needy, you know. <laughs> That's my girl. Oh, she's something else. Needy and expect you to uh, do what she needs you to do when she needs you to do it. Patience and, you know, she be patient. She be nice. She do. She be like, touch it, be tell me she hungry. She be like, tissue out with her paw. Like, you cool, you all right, you sleep. Uh, can you feed me? <clears throat> Animals are so intelligent. Fear. <sighs> Thank you to all my new subs assessing. Oh, here we go with that assessing shit. Balance. People be on your page. Why do people be bothering y'all? Yeah, Assessing if you balanced or not. Like, what the fuck you trying to cause me? An imbalance, bitch? Why is you assessing my balance? Wisdom. They envious of y'all wisdom. These people assessing y'all platforms. Envious of your wisdom. But you went through hell to get it. Release. Y'all releasing some people. Yeah, envious motherfuckers. Can't help being with who you are. I ain't about to compromise who I am to appease your motherfucking ass. You can forget that, Jack. Beginnings. Yeah, some of y'all release some shit. Y'all have new beginnings on this new moon, or a new beginning is coming on the next new moon. The last new moon was September 25th. Wisdom. Y'all may ascertain some more wisdom. The Wayne and Gibbons moon, which will be ten ten in Aries after the full moon in Aries, which is a hunter's moon. So y'all definitely gonna come into some wisdom after the hunter's moon. And then y'all will be releasing some shit on the next Wayne and Crescent moon. Y'all released some shit on this last way in the Crescent Moon, which was September 19th. Y'all probably was crying like a motherfucker because it was in cancer. Mm -hmm. So you had a lot of sheer, uh, tear, tear shedding. Let me see the next one. Y'all may do some more releasing. You know, the next way in Crescent is on October 18th in Leo. So y'all may be doing a little bit more crying. In October, me in October, just to release some shit, transmute, mm-hmm, and step into y'all power. This card remind me of Scorpio. It really do. Mm, mm, mm. People sound else, ain't they? Y'all ain't even paying them no attention. Y'all looking up like y'all reading books or looking up higher, you know, higher vibrational shit, and releasing people. Going into a new beginning and they steadily assessing what wisdom you came into, whether or not you're gonna be fucking with them anymore, kind of shit. Are they gonna be a part of the new beginning? If you better ask them questions, more than likely not. You know? People ruin they ruin their chances with stuff. I'm talking about ruin. Science. Some of y'all want to get off into my product. <clears throat> peace. Y'all want peace after a tower. They say ruin. Something happened with y'all. Felt like y'all, somebody said ruin y'all motherfucking life. Y'all love life and that. Y'all got wisdom up all love. I tell you that. Mm-hmm. Completion. Some people say y'all gay and y'all ain't. People just be making up shit. It's completion with that shit. Whatever y'all gonna be crying over and releasing, it's over. 
We ain't gonna never go through that shit again. Gotta be out there fucking man. Right. Stepping in luxury. That's why they want to come. Because they want to know if they, you know. To me, I may be 42 or 44. Like me. Look up that angel number. 244 or 442. Definitely foundation. Y'all definitely going to end up in a partnership. Or a love situation with somebody. Even if you is gay, that's your motherfucking business. The will of fortune. You're going to end up in a love partnership with whoever the fuck y'all going to be with. Yeah, and that's y'all business. Some of y'all going to get into filmmaking. It's like practice sex alchemy to increase your revenue. Power couples advised. So if you are bathed up, then do some money magic. Create some alchemy to increase your revenue. Some of y'all talk about, I'm going for dominion. I know that's right. It's that give up the need to be right. Some of y'all are in same-sex relationships. Give up the need to be right, Scorpio. Y'all have a hard time with that shit. Two, two, y'all got master numbers. Y'all master builders. Two, two, and four, four. Mm -hmm. Y'all master, master builders. Not to be fucked with. That's for sure. Yeah, the wheel about to turn in y'all favor in the love department. It's gonna be a whole completion of whatever the fuck happens. It made y'all sad as fuck. Y'all can write a movie about that shit. Y'all just might document it. Whole ass new beginning. Life of luxury and dominion. Some of y'all may not have even wanted to embrace a luxurious lifestyle, but you ended up just saying, okay, because this. This was written in the card thing. People mad. They can be mad all they want. What the fuck they got to do with you? You can't help what's written in the stars. You really can't. People be trying to change it, but I mean, they really just be wasting time. And incurring karma like a motherfucker. Some of y'all were in the times of Egypt. Some of y'all come from Egyptian times. The hermit. Y'all tell me what a Virgo. What crazy ass motherfucking energy. This is a crazy ass energy, y'all. These are the people that be assessing y'all social platforms. Okay? And y'all know Lauren is not crazy, but she playing the hell out of this part, ain't she? Don't even feel creepy. It's how they be on y'all. So it's people that want to be like y'all. Doppelgangers. What wisdom you got? Want to be partnered up with you and shit. But they don't quite qualify. They don't quite make the cut. But they keep trying. Oh, Biggie came out. <laughs> Biggie came out. Whole life or death situation. They keep fucking with y'all. I swear to God. I can't even find them. That's how creepy it is. I, I did the deck like this. Biggie was showing. Now I can't find them no more. Mm. You know what? Some of y'all are mentally fucking resilient, strong. I always say that about Scorpios. I don't give a fuck what nobody said. Y'all are the rising, y'all the phoenix, rising from the ashes. Y'all be having the most crash and burns I ever seen in my motherfucking life. <laughs> Come back straight like this, like ain't nothing happened. Resilient like Capricorns. Mm -hmm. Wise, devoted, responsible, creative, loyal, family oriented, mysterious. That's where the wisdom lie at, too. People be trying to figure y'all out and they can't. Y'all highly intuitive, warm, and happy. Naturally happy people. Naturally devoted, generous. So people can play y'all. Y'all got leadership qualities. So people always want to be a part of y'all visions and shit. Y'all virtuous and loving. But they don't make the cut. <laughs> this nigga man. They really don't know. Then they don't do shit but be backstabbing vultures. Look at Biggie. I told you all. Him and Pac was hiding. It was two of them together. See what I'm saying? We be on some other shit. This wanted to come up in reverse, but it didn't. Mm -hmm. Some of y'all may be moody like a cancer, or y'all got cancer in y'all chart. 
And some of y'all are highly intuitive, for real. Y'all be having visions. Y'all are prophetic. Mm -hmm. Some of y'all go through some form of mental, mental anguish or inner turmoil. Y'all got to stay grounded, you know? For real. Because people are trying to fuck with y'all on the emotional disturbances side. Biggie talking about it be dead. He don't never come up really for real. Biggie be, I mean, he's silent. He's he moving in silence. Use wisdom at this time. Ancestors guiding is heavily present. Signs of deep grieving. Some of y'all may be grieving. Transformation is a sight. End of a cycle. Release. Come right up under release. Choose life. Mm -hmm. Y'all may get um, a phone call that somebody died. Practice self-care at this time. Mm -hmm. Y'all may get a phone call that somebody died. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Oh, that was harsh. Three of Pentacles. Yeah, y'all dedicated to achieve. Y'all dedicated to y'all craft. It's like y'all keep having to start over because of these fuck faces that always want to link up with y'all and do business, but they don't know how to do business. They want this. Yeah, man, go somewhere. You do not know what you're doing. You're not loyal like me. You're not dedicated like me. You don't have the intuition or the wisdom that I have. Like, I'm called to do this. And sometimes y'all could want to bring people on board or y'all have been known to bring people on board and just end up always getting backstabbed or some shit. Y'all could have did y'all self canny shit. Y'all releasing that kind of shit. It's like self-sabotaging or just trying to be a little bit too helpful. Look at him. He gonna come up, y'all. Why not <laughs> put the deck? I'm about to put the deck away, right? He just sitting on top of the deck like this. The whole deck is how it's supposed to be. He just sitting on top of the deck like this. You know what? This is a highly ancestral reading. Y'all got Biggie. Lisa left eye, she came with Tupac, and now Nipsey. Do the hustle. <sighs> what can you do? Gotta keep starting over for people that are incompetent, but it's not you that's incompetent. It's crazy, crazy. Y'all about to knock that shit off. Y'all walking through a brand new door. Y'all for good. All that shit they used to get off. I haven't long they been getting it off with y'all. They ain't about to be able to get that shit off no more. That shit dead as fuck. Especially when y'all get this new love situation going on. Oh, baby. When I tell you it's over for one. Mm-hmm. Trying to impede y'all progress. Yeah, just go with the flow. Just trying to impede progress. What can you do? Uh-huh. Y'all gonna walk through that new door. And baby, when I say... Everything gonna start moving at the speed of light. Cause it's just motherfuckers that was blocking all the time. And y'all knew that shit. Like I know the fuck you lying. Not again. Like yeah, you gotta start over. So that means y'all could be way richer than y'all are. Y'all gonna have way more. And y'all rule the eighth house, which is other people's resources. So some people were standing in the way of y'all coming into fortune just through an inheritance kind of shit. True. Yeah. Swindlers. Always looking to come up. Like y'all, that would say this is y'all though. Y'all see how people are? Y'all are ruled by the eighth house. So y'all all, I mean, y'all rule life insurance kind of shit. But they would say y'all is this, but this be them always trying to link up. Because they know like intuitively or something. Like primal instinct kind of shit, like animal kind of shit, that y'all got some money coming kind of shit. People sell things. I'm trying to tell you. Y'all don't have to be strong because people are trying to pull so much stupid shit off of the world. Night of Wands. <laughs> some of y'all know this for real. For real. What's that fire nature in y'all? Like, yay, honey. You got it. Give it to him, queen. <laughs> it's coming to the light now. They ain't trying to play y'all. They can't play y'all. The hermit. Mm-hmm. Y'all hip to these motherfuckers standing still. Because y'all done been through it for so many times with these motherfuckers. Once y'all come into union with who y'all with, or if y'all didn't come into union, 
or y'all going to come into union with somebody, it's really over for them. It really is. And y'all gonna sleep good at night. Y'all probably been sleeping like this after good cries. Mm-hmm. Releasing shit. Grieving. Oh, shit. Shit people did to y'all. Mm-hmm. Some of y'all high priestess energy. Just tapped in. Tuned in. Know what the fuck be going on. And y'all done experienced it so many times. Y'all already see motherfuckers before they... Yeah, man. The moon. Again. These people subconscious thoughts. And I think that's what... Let me see, y'all. The eight house is all about that shit. It is. Y'all some transmitting fools. I just said, y'all would be good for um any James Brown candles. You Everybody can't fuck with James Brown. You gotta be true to this, not new to this. If you're in a Phoenix Rising type of situation where you crash and burn all the time, James Brown would definitely be good for you. He'll take your hand through some dark ass shit. But everybody ain't cut to go through dark ass shit immediately. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Ten of swords in reverse. You all the crash and burns. It'd be like this, and then it'd be like this. <laughs> it'd be like this, and then it'd be like this. Y'all just be coming up out that shit. And sleeping like babies like nothing ever happened. <sighs> Sex, hidden, passion, regret, secrets. Y'all rule occult science. There it is. Natural alchemist. Y'all rule alchemy, mystery, occult science. I know it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Y'all rule emotional intelligence. Y'all fix. Mm-hmm. Obsessive. Possessive. Vindictive. Extreme. Transformation. Relentless. Sex appeal. Feisty. Mm-hmm. 777 is y'all number. Look it up. Okay. Life insurance. Taboos. So y'all be seeing motherfuckers. What's in their subconscious? The dark shit about them. Regenerative. Y'all regenerative. I know y'all passion burns, man. They come right back. No transformative energy. Y'all rule credit cards. Spiritual debt. So a lot of motherfuckers is in spiritual debt with y'all. Mm -hmm. Wanna play that witchcraft card on y'all? Man, when I say that boomerang gonna hit them so mean, this y'all ass right here. <laughs> Strong as fuck. When it comes to understanding certain shit, Cause y'all rule all the shit that's tied to basically esoteric knowledge, occult science, mysteries. <sighs> the underbelly though, knock people the fuck out. For real. You would think it was just gonna be a little sting. No. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <laughs> oh, y'all leave people in pain for a little minute, minute. And be looking just like this. Oh, me? Yeah, you leave people looking just like this. Come fucking around. Y'all got a dark side. Y'all can go here, too. For real. Y'all get this person? I don't know. So many lessons in love on this candy shit. I just feel like you got to die if you just die. Bring you out of that shit. Like, How did I survive that shit? Mm hmm. Some of y'all only gonna need a smaller circle like this. Ain't not a whole lot of people. Always wanna team up, group up, and shit. When it really just be money they looking for. Thirsty as a motherfucker. <gasps> Say nothing, Scorpio. Messy on social media. They either be saying this about y'all or they ass is. Always up to no good. Assessing what the fuck you doing being messy. I'm gonna say it's you. Ain't that a bitch? I'm tired of the bullshit, you know. Some of y'all are straight meditation mode. Mm hmm. Just chilling. King of Cups energy. Scorpio man. Mm -hmm. I mean, eat pain for dinner. Damn. 
crying out and keep going. Y'all can feel good with the James Brown candles. <laughs> Uncle James ain't no joke. Y'all want to go really crazy? Listen to his music to get it in your subconscious. You talking about a trip. You be shining like no money, though. The ascension be ridiculous. The wisdom be ridiculous. King of Pentacles in reverse. Oh, okay. So they want to take y'all money. Okay, but y'all didn't even went about that in the first motherfucking place. Y'all trying to go. Y'all, okay. So y'all did it. Y'all deal. Y'all do whatever y'all do for the love of it. For some reason, people are envious of your devotion and the love for what you do. You're just a builder. Okay. It doesn't matter if they put you in a king of pentacles in reverse. And some of them tell lies on you that you're like that. A king of pentacles in reverse. Which is something really toxic as fuck. Let's see. And it ain't even that, thank liars. Making that shit up, being messy. Overly cautious, paranoid, poverty mindset. What? Fear of loss, highly opinionated, lacks empathy, cold hearted, untrustworthy, unfair in dealings, tendency to project inner ugliness, materialistic, shallow, bitter, vices, possibly perversity. So these are all of the little uh, lies that be going on, especially if you're a male Scorpio. But look, the motherfuckers that are saying that is these motherfuckers. They're projecting, basically. However, the lies that they tell affect your money. That's a form of witchcraft. And some of them trick themselves into believing that you're like that just to be able to practice witchcraft peacefully. You know, give them a clear conscience why they're doing what they do. Because y'all did have a moon card come up twice. And that is connected to illusions, imagination, and emotional disturbances along with deception. So motherfuckers tricking their own man into believing that y'all are a certain way just to be able to do that witchcraft in peace, which affects some of y'all money. People saw me. I'm going to pop three more, then we're going to get up our... It was two, 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 two on the clock. Y'all are master fucking builders. Look up them numbers, y'all. Two, two, four, four, two, two, four, four. Now the pinnacle. Some of y'all in the singular energy. Because you uprooting some shit. You uprooting some shit. You releasing some shit. Some deep rooted toxic ass fucking shit. So when you do get in a relationship or a union should I say. Because shit sink. You're going to be so happy and so contented. And not. It's going to be a whole lot of vibe. I could just feel it in my bones. It came up. Love was the first thing that came up. So that's what y'all want. Y'all just know. Some of y'all know y'all got to get to the root of some shit. To get to, to get here. Woo! Ain't that good? Oh, wait. Mm, mm, mm. Some of y'all is good girls. Or good guys. People just be lying. Oh, they make me sick. <laughs> they really do. Y'all gonna get the victory over the devil. Yes. It's the devil card. Y'all gonna get the victory. Some of y'all have been through bad marriages, bad relationships, bad this, bad that. Y'all getting to the root of this shit. Some old ass past life shit. Y'all dealing with y'all selves. Um, and y'all feel good about it. Y'all gonna get to the root of that shit and gain victory over that fucking generational curses and shit. Deep rooted shit. Y'all gonna get to it. Get the love of y'all life. Y'all got it at the beginning of the read and the end, honey. Y'all don't get no better than that shit. It don't matter if you're in the same sex situation or not. It's your business, business. This is the love card in the Urban Tarot. This is the lover's card in the Lysias Tarot, honey. Good job, Scorpio. All right, y'all. If you feel the vibe, please like, share, and subscribe. Love and light. Like.